1991, the city Center for Information Technology Innovation is investigating adaptive graphical user interfaces with force feedback. The pantograph is a force feedback pointing device intended for direct manipulation in a human-computer interaction. The mechanical structure is based on a 5-bar linkage that guarantees stability, little friction, and provides a comfortable 10 by 16 centimeters workspace. Two powerful motors allow numerical control over the manipulated knob, thus giving the user a sensation of touch of a physical nature. Force feedback is an emerging concept in human-computer interaction aimed at enhancing or translating graphical information with touchable information. Such interfaces are especially relevant not only for visually handicapped persons or for astronauts working in space without gravity, but also for sighted users. Some ergonomical experiments have shown that introducing force feedback in addition to vision or audition improves substantially performance and comfort. On the other hand, force feedback technologies offer a new performance support system paradigm. Since a force feedback device is used as the pointing device, it allows the system to physically guide the user's hand from one location to another. The goal of our research is to facilitate the use and training of direct manipulation interfaces using a force feedback device as a physical assistant. In order to design the physical assistant, a Wizard of Oz technique was investigated. The user is now manipulating the force feedback device as a mouse. He points, selects, drags and resizes. Since the behavior of the pantograph is programmable, the pantograph can take part of the control to achieve some tasks, and the user will feel a real-time determined force guiding his hand. The Wizard of Oz technique is an experimental mechanism that allows observation of users interacting with a system having apparently all its functionalities. With the Wizard of Oz technique, it's a hidden operator that controls the pantograph through a simple mouse. The hidden operator is watching the user and takes over as soon as some help is apparently needed. Actually, the Wizard of Oz allows to easily simulate a service and also to design the service itself and then to automate it. Artificial neural networks were designed to replace progressively the wizard's reactions. Firstly, artificial neural networks have to learn and memorize users' behaviors. At this stage, the user doesn't feel any force. Then progressively, the user senses a change in the interface. A haptic feedback steers the pantograph, attempting to physically guide the user's hand towards spatially defined objects. Therefore, adaptive user interfaces with force feedback provide designers with a powerful new assistance metaphor since it's based on a natural way of training. <laughs>